After reevaluating her unsuccessful math lesson, Lindsay Tavares decides to rework the goal she initially had for the lesson. The way that I came up with my goal for this lesson before I used UDL applied to it was um, I had looked at the materials in front of me and I had sort of made a marriage between the standards and what I had with materials and sort of come up with this hybrid goal that talked about what they needed to learn but also what materials they were going to use, um, which was my first mistake. Initially I had thought that that was just, you know, giving extra detail, being very complete in my lesson planning, things like that, but that was totally backwards. That was boxing myself and all of us into something very narrow that didn't give me a lot of room to meet the needs of all the learners in my classroom. I realized that, you know, the first part of my goal was okay, the one that was aligned to the standards and just talked about what they actually had to learn and had to be able to understand, it was the fact that I had embedded the means in the goal that was causing all these problems for me. And in my case, that implied scissors and cutting and pasting and all sorts of things that just turned out to be a nightmare in terms of classroom management. As soon as I realized that I had embedded the means in the goal and that had you know, brought up all these barriers that I was trying to face in my lesson, then as soon as I was able to eliminate that, my goal was much more streamlined in a way, but also much more broad um, because it was able to let me you know, go about achieving that goal any way that I needed to with the learners that I had in front of me.